Hello, welcome to the CWP tutorial. In this video, we'll be taking a look at how to run WordPress with Nginx PHP FPM. When changing your web server to Nginx, WordPress pages on the server using pretty permalinks will fail to load. This is because WordPress uses the .htaccess file to manipulate how Apache serves files from its root and subdirectories. Most notably, WordPress modifies this file to be able to handle pretty permalinks. However, Nginx does not use the .htaccess file, so as a workaround, we can simply add a rewrite rule and set Nginx to run PHP FPM. To do this, we'll start from the CWP dashboard and under the navigation pane, we'll open the web server's settings submenu and select web server's domain config to open the web server configuration module. This next step will have to be repeated for each WordPress installation. So select a user of a domain running WordPress and click Create Configuration. From the drop down, select Nginx PHP FPM. If you don't see any Nginx options here, it's probably because you're currently running Apache. So go to the Select Web Servers module, and here you'll see a variety of server options, including Apache only, Nginx only, Lightspeed Enterprise. Nginx and Apache, Nginx and Varnish, or Nginx, Varnish, and Apache. Any of the Nginx options can run Nginx PHP FPM. However, all others will work with Apache. This is a particularly great feature to have in the case of shared hosting, since then you can have some sites running Nginx and PHP FPM, while others are running Nginx and Apache, so they won't need any custom configuration. If there are many different scripts on the server, they will all work since they don't need any custom config in Nginx, as they use Apache by default. Then you can apply Nginx PHP FPM only for those sites which need it. For now, we'll just select Nginx only. Then scroll down to save and rebuild the configuration, and select Web Servers Domain Config. Now you can click the drop down and select Nginx PHP FPM. Under Nginx Configuration, set the Nginx default vhost template type to PHP FPM, and set the Nginx default vhost template to WordPress. Select your desired PHP FPM version, and be sure to check this box to rebuild web server config for domain on save. Then click Save. WordPress should now work for this domain and related subdomains but you will have to repeat the web server configuration for all other WordPress installations. However, if you have a great many domains to configure this way, there is a way to specify the default web server template for all new accounts and domains. Just go back to the web server settings submenu and select web servers main conf. And this opens the manage web servers configuration module. Here we can select the Nginx default vhost template type as PHP FPM and then set the template to WordPress. We can select the PHP FPM version and the default PHP FPM template, in this case, WordPress. Then be sure to check mark the box, rebuild all vhosts on save and save your changes. These settings will now be used for all new accounts and domains. And that's how to run WordPress on Nginx only. For further details, please refer to the following links. We hope you found this tutorial useful. Thank you very much for watching.